What is the healthiest vegetable to eat? Broccoli. Broccoli? What do you think? Cauliflower. Cauliflower? The idea is it's BC grown fruits and vegetables. Make them available on a regular basis to kids in schools. It's not a it's not a, a, a food program for hungry kids. It's a program to introduce kids to first of all fruits and vegetables so that it's a special thing when it you know the, that special day every two weeks that happens and second introduce them to BC grown uh, fruits and vegetables because we need to be supporting our local producers. And there's another vegetable that's actually a herb. Do you know what something that we think is a fruit and it's actually a herb. Do you know what that could be? Can you guess? We're starting it in September, and uh, it's going to be an expansion for the next two, next couple of school years. I think it's going to be great for kids to be able to eat BC grown fruit. It's great for their producers too, because that's where we buy from. Who wants red and who wants yellow? Red, 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 red. I think the thing is, is that a lot of parents are really busy, and it, you know, fruits and vegetables aren't always the first thing that kids want to eat. So it, it takes a little bit of time to cajole your kids in lots of cases, I think into eating fruits and vegetables and when you're a very busy parent sometimes you don't have the, you, you, maybe you don't make the effort. So I think there are a lot of kids that don't get introduced to fruits and vegetables the way that we might have when we were kids. So um, this program makes it a little special for them and so that when they, you know, every two weeks when it arrives it's a special occasion and it, it just, I, hopefully it gives it a little bit of, um, it gives the fruit and vegetables a little bit of star power that they might not otherwise have had.